girl, cousin, I am so hot and I am so steaming that I can't even have any tea today. I just can't because I think I think my ears will start whistling like the candle. Is that what it's called, candle? <laughs> Could you please tell me? Look at the picture on this thumbnail. Look at the picture. Compliments of Merida at First Sight inside of Prom uh, Instagram. Okay, I'm going to be doing the thing y'all want me to do later, but I can't today. Okay, because I taped another video and then I saw this and I was like. Why is, why is this woman sitting next to this woman's husband with her twat almost sticking out with the big old chicken leg? Hmm. With the big old leg sticking out with that come F me dress, you know? And at first when I saw the picture, you know, the other picture, I think I posted and Paige has on this black thing. I say, why is Sister Paige looking so homely, though? I have turned her over to the elders of the church, because I can't help her. And the girl has on the mm, throw me on the wall and do me dress. But then I saw Sister, Sister Paige's boots, girl, and I was like, well, maybe Paige came to fight. And she was like, mm, I'm going to put my jeans on and my shirt. You're not about to scratch my arms up, honey. And I will pluck your eyes out with these heels. Girl, you know, I already had another video, and I was like, when I saw this, I said, no, I got to come on here. I, what? It, somebody please tell me, why is the ex meeting the wife? Why is Chris' ex fiance now meeting Chris' new wife? Girl, I just, I can't. Please be sure to thumbs up and share this. I remember my books on Amazon and, 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 and wherever else. Okay. Oh, thank you guys for your love and support for February. I was able to meet my goal. I think somebody bought last few minutes, somebody bought three books and that kind of put me over the top. So thank you. I appreciate the love. But girl, I am so like oozing with hotness because I just don't understand why Merit at First Sight is doing this. Like, this is like the worst, most trashiest, worst season of all 12 seasons that I've watched. And I've watched all 12 of them. Some of them I fell off because I was like, oh, please, already y'all not going to work out. I just don't understand why is Married at First Sight, the one little show I was watching and like that is not basketball wives, not the real housewives fighting and throwing stuff. And now they're bringing the the, the basketball wives and the, 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 the housewives crazy and shenanigans with the ex-boyfriend cheating on this one and you got pregnant for this one and you knocked up. For this one, by the way, you heard it here first. She wasn't pregnant, okay. By the way, allegedly, allegedly, girl. And and I don't care what Dr. Pepper, fake Pascal say, or phony behind Dr. Viviana, you cannot tell me that this is not for ratings. There is no reason to bring the ex-fiance on here. And did you notice that her booty is just as big as Paige's booty? Because I was trying to look at her to see what was it about her. Uh, she got big legs. Mm, 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 mm. She looked 34. She she looked 34. Mm, look at Paige. Paige is, all, Paige is all leaned in. This fool over here with his ashy legs and probably funky behind shoes is like, no, I be, they're all paid. I don't believe these people are real. They're not, they're not real. It's not real. This has to be <clears throat> paid because there is no way Paige I just don't understand why Paige is going through this. It just makes no sense to me unless she's getting paid. And girl, I hope they're paying you a whole lot of money for playing the foolish black woman on the TV, girl. Because God knows we don't, after, you know, Sister Michelle in the White House, we don't need black women being no fools and acting like an idiot, okay? We need you to act right, do right, be right, and be right. But no, Sister Paige, you coming on TV acting like a fool. I just hope they're paying you enough, sis. Because there is no way, I'm just letting you know, 
I hope they're giving you like a million dollars or something because it you you can't tell me you're on here being a fool and an idiot and playing. I just can't. I don't understand it. I mean, <laughs> Paige, you can't be this stupid, are you? You can't be this. <sighs> you know, I've just been kind of trying to wrap my mind around this. Oh, this is a vent, okay? I just, for the sake of me, Sister Paige, I don't understand it. You know what I mean? Mm, mm, mm. And then they're going to say it's not for, 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 uh, and, and did y'all hear, I feel like, and I'm going to do another video on this, I feel like both PASA, P-A-S-S-A Cal, and Dr. Pepper is trying to blame this all on, on Paige. Like, well, we, we've told her she could leave and she wanted to stick it out. And I'm like, Paige, why you want to stick it out? Huh? You're trying to run this man down so he can do what love you. And I really do think Paige was trying to get pregnant, girl. This is all this stuff I'm getting on my chest, all this stuff I was getting, getting thinking about. Then she come to the bar, to the, to the fight with plastic knives. So I don't care what they say. This is for ratings. I don't, I just, these people are acting. And did y'all see last week how, how the charlatan was smiling and carrying on? Did y'all see that? Because the couple of pictures I took her, he was smirking and smiling. And even Pastor Carol, I'm going to find the picture. Eva passed the cow. Amazon. Eva passed the cow was smiling and carrying on. And I'm like, well, if this is so real and serious, why are they smiling and carrying on, girl? And I just couldn't, I just couldn't wrap my mind around it. And I think, I think they're fake. I think they're actors and I think they're pretending. And I don't think, uh, I don't think any of this stuff. And girl, look at how, uh, Mike, Amazon is outside. And girl, look at how the ex, the ex-fiance was throwing her fingers up in Sister Paige's face. See, I don't like that. See, I would have to get somebody. Okay, and this is the picture I said I saw with Paige come looking all homely, like she going to a funeral or something. Okay? And the girl come with the doomy dress on, just pop the titty out and, <laughs> and throw it in his mouth. Okay? And so let me know what y'all think, y'all. Look at this. I just, I just, y'all, I just, this is it. Look at this idiot. I just can't wrap my mind around why Sister Paige would want to go through this. God knows she ain't that desperate for a man. They must, this is, this has got to be acting. I, I don't believe for one more second this is real anymore. I'm sorry. Thou shall not try me. Don't try me, married at first sight, because this can't be real. This has got to be fake. I mean, Paige just keeps every time he called, I want my ex fiance, you want my ex fiance to meet. I would have said, for what? That's why I think they're paying her. They are paying her to act the foolish black woman on TV because ain't no way you're going to be messed to testing some black girl like that, honey. Let me tell you, we will throw down. I don't care how desperate we are, honey. We will fight some. <laughs> Not we because, you know, I don't fight. I'm too cute. So, y'all, let me know what you, this thing is just bothering me. You know, I've been missing sleep over this situation. <laughs> I've been missing sleep, girl, and I just, you know, I just can't. This is, this has got to be fake. Let me know what y'all think. Why y'all think this woman is sitting next to this other woman's husband like that? And why didn't the charlatan get his behind up and sit over there next to his wife? He's sitting over here with the baby mama, allegedly. With the F me dress, with the booty, all all this out, all of the leg, everything is just out. All all he got to do is just you know. Mm, I need to go take my blood pressure. I gotta take my blood pressure. 
and I'm gonna get me a brown paper bag. Okay, does the kids get their lunch in brown paper bags? Oh, they don't know more. Girl, let me know what you think. Check my books out on Amazon. I'm just too over this show. I'm, you know, I might be done with Married at First Sight after this. Two or three thousand guys, you might meet the nigga. What? I might be done with Married at First Sight after this. I can't take it no more. Mm -mm, I just can't. The fakery, the 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 crookedness, the 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 Real Housewives drama. I mean, this is not. This is this is too much for my spirit. Okay, this is not supposed to be a Married at First Sight. Okay. But anyways, I have to go. I'm just so devastated about this. I'm devastated about Paige. I just can't believe she's such a foolish woman. I just don't believe that Paige is playing the fool like this girl. She don't have no... And where's her mama and her three daddies and the brothers and the uncles and the cousins and the people from the neighborhood? Why aren't they on the TV? <laughs> Fight. <laughs> Let me know what y'all think. I just can't take it no more. Please tell me this is fake news. Please tell me I'm in a nightmare. <laughs> I'm married at first sight nightmare. I love y'all. Bye, guys. Mwah.